Oh, hi! Welcome to the video. Today we've got three delicious new high protein vegan fat loss recipes for you to enjoy. Here's breakfast. So I'm going to make kind of a high protein soya yogurt, kind of a Buddha bowl, but with fruits and granola. It's going to be amazing. So we've got 250 grams of unsweetened soya yogurt. Obviously trying to keep the cows down. Also, obviously refined sugar is not a healthy endeavor. I've got this awesome from Veg Nutrition. It's their vanilla ice cream flavor. And I've got quite a whole scoop there, come on. Super delicious and obviously that's gonna add a hell of a lot of protein to the mix while keeping the calories relatively low. That's the trick when you're on low calories is keeping your protein high enough. So we're gonna mix that through. You'll need to finish it with a whisk just to get all the lumps out. So in your presentation bowl, now I'm gonna add 60 grams of varying fruits. So we're going with some bloobs and we want some fresh mango. Got some nice straws. Nana. Accidentally held up Don't tell them about that. <laughs> the last fruit is a peach. For a bit of bite and to add in some good starches and fats, we've got this Gut Loving Granola by Bio and Me. This one's got no added sugar, so it's a real helpful one, low in cows. 25 grams. Now this has already got some ground flax seeds in there for omega-3, but we needed more omega-3 throughout the day. So we're gonna add a heaping tablespoon of milled chia, and that'll make sure that we've got adequate amounts. And for more antioxidants, we'll add a little cinnamon as well. Meal one comes in at 619 calories for 42 grams of protein, 57 grams of carbs, and 20 grams of fat. Bonus tip. Ordinarily, you know, if you're a strength or physique athlete, you use protein shakes, right? Well, when you're cutting and you're not eating so much volume of food, it's good not to drink your calories. So something that can displace the protein powder is something like seitan. Uh, this isn't as lean as a, a protein isolate powder, but it is leaner probably than a concentrate is. For this little serving of seitan, it's 36 grams of protein, six grams of carbs, and just one gram of fat. Uh, and it tastes blinking delicious. I'll put the link below uh, for that one so you can go and check it out. Mm. For lunch, we're making a delicious mushroom and chickpea Burberry bowl with a lime and pomegranate salad. You are gonna need one can of chickpeas, half a medium onion, seven mushrooms, two teaspoons of Burberry spice, one teaspoon ground coriander, half a teaspoon each of ground cumin, paprika, garlic powder and onion powder, salt to taste, 120 mils of water, and lemon juice also to taste. Step one, chop your it up. <laughs> Pop it on a medium heat, we're gonna add the water in and the spices. Mix well. Don't forget your chickpeas, of course. And now cook until the water has mostly evaporated. While that's happening, I'm gonna get 55 grams of quinoa on to cook. For the lime and pomegranate salad, you're gonna need 30 grams of pomegranate arils, quarter of an onion, a medium tomato, fresh chili pepper to taste. You won't want a whole lot, I should imagine. <laughs> Tablespoon of lime juice, 100 grams of spinach, one tablespoon of pumpkin seeds, half a teaspoon of mustard, and salt and pepper to taste. Chopping! In goes the pomegranate, the spices, a tablespoon of lime juice, and give it a mix. It's gonna chop this spinach down to size. I'm gonna make a nice little salad layer. This may seem like a lot of greens to some people, but number one, if you wanna be healthy, that's the kind of amounts that we should be eating at a meal, at least. 
And uh, number two, when you're dieting, just helps fill you up so you don't get hungry between meals. Meals. Meal two comes in at 643 calories for 34 grams of protein, 81 grams of carbs, and 13 grams of fat. For lunch, we're making high protein summer rolls. You will need four rice papers, 200 grams of tofu, three tablespoons of PV2. This stuff is amazing. If you don't know PV2, it's defatted peanut butter, it's powdered, so it's 90% less fat, so super low calories, and a really good whack of protein. You'll also need a quarter of a cucumber, one and a half carrots, half a red pepper, a few leaves of lettuce, two tablespoons of soy milk, half a tablespoon of maple syrup, half a tablespoon of nutritional yeast, and two tablespoons of soy sauce. First of all, we need to deal with the tofu. We'll pop it in the press. You can, as we always say, pop it underneath uh, some books wrapped in a tea towel and let them press it. But this is the official way to do it. You know, if you're all cool in that. So that needs to sit for 10 minutes. While that's happening, we can be chopping some vegetables. Now we need to chop our tofu into batons. What do you reckon, mate? About down the middle there? Yeah. We're just going to flavour this with a tablespoon of soy sauce. Ordinarily, you'd go a bit more sexy with the marinade, but the sauce, the dipping uh, sauce, is the star of the show, so no need. So just uh, just kind of salting it up a bit, bit of an umami flavour. And then that'll go in the air fryer. 15 minutes at 200 degrees Celsius, 400 Fahrenheit. Obviously you can do them in a conventional oven as well, just takes five minutes longer. Now for the high protein peanut dip, so we've got the PB2. All the taste of peanuts with 90% less fat. Not sponsored. Half a teaspoon of vegan crack or, or nooch. Or tablespoon. Tablespoon even, can't get the stuff. <laughs> One tablespoon soy sauce. Two tablespoons soya milk. You put three, but you said two. That's three, isn't it? Yes. Three. <laughs> You're right in a minute. Sorry, I feel. <laughs> it's because I didn't eat no meat. After that. <laughs> what is it? Tablespoon, obviously. Yeah, but what? What is it? What do you think? I'm stupid. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Give it a mix. And then just add a little water at a time until you reach your desired consistency. Smells like peanuts. <laughs> no <laughs> Sherlock. <laughs> and then optional but recommended, chili powder to taste. That's better. That's amazing. That's <laughs> so tasty. Wow. Don't put it. <laughs> mm. Now the fun part, making them up. So first we're going to whack the rice paper for a few seconds. Okay, and so we'll put some lettuce. That might be a little long. Cucumber. Red pepper, carrot, and some tofu. Put a bit more lettuce on the top. And then you want to wrap it really tight. So you just roll it up from the bottom, pull the fillings in. And as I say, just keep it really tight. So that, and you just tuck the ends in. Oh, that's stuck together. Don't do that. So I've got a nice wet blade now. We just want to bisect them. Look at that. Cool. So fresh. 
Meal three comes in at 518 calories for 37 grams of protein, 55 grams of carbs, and 15 grams of fat. I'm so excited. This is one of my very favorite recipes at the minute. Get a bit of sauce on there. Mmm. That tastes so fresh, but then you've got the delicious peanut and like the heat coming through. My mouth's watering, I can't wait to smash these down. So just as a fun little exercise, I've popped all the foods into the Chronometer app. You'll see we got just over 2000 calories there for 150 grams of protein, 213 net grams of carbs and 49 grams of fat. All you little trolls, you anti-vegans in the comment section saying about how a vegan diet's not nutritious and yours is amazing. Well, look at what I managed to get with just 2,000 calories and uh, let's see what you can do. And remember, nobody's dying of deficiencies. Everyone's dying of excess. And it's things like saturated fat, well, it's less than 10 grams there, trans fats and cholesterol. This is zero cholesterol in a healthy whole foods vegan diet. If you want to optimize your health, body shape, or sports performance, check out our online coaching service. Unlike other people where it's BS cookie cutter so they can get loads of numbers through the door, this is really in-depth, hand-holding, bespoke to you as an individual, which is why it works so well. So give that a look-see. Otherwise, we'll see you in the next video. Bonus tip.